yeah, yep. it just phases off. But you get to do Dark Passage now, so. That's the motherfucking titties. Have fun with that level. I don't remember that level very much at all. Me neither. How is Shika? She... We haven't talked about her today. No, we haven't. She is currently laying in the blanket behind us. She passed out on my lap like an hour ago, and she's been asleep ever since. And yeah, which is good because we don't have to worry about her while we're while we're we're uh, recording, which is you know makes it optimal recording time. Because honestly, we should always try to record when she is asleep, as opposed to being her rowdy up and at him, wild zoomy self. Yeah. <laughs> All right, it's gonna take me a second to get used to the controls again. You have to go around the other way to get back. I know, I'm just looking okay. around, getting my... Yeah. You'll have to hit the timer, dude, and then... Uh, or actually, no, I'm pretty sure you only need that to do gems. You can just use the... But there, I can speak today. The hover panel things, lift, cylinders, yes. whatever you want to call them. And guess what? What? My potatoes are going to be done in about six minutes. Well, then we can start the level, cut when you need to get them, and then we'll start again when they're done. We'll just, we need to, like, put up, like, a intermission. A little Or cute. I'll just cut. Fine. I mean, unless you want to draw something for an intermission card. I will. Okay. Get on that. I will. Okay. Then go for it. Do it. I am. It's going to be a... I'm not gonna spoil it, guys. Okay. Shh. Get out of here. Oh, fucking shit. You wanted this level. I did want this level. I do want this level. I like this level. This level's fun. I'm just gonna fucking destroy everything. Aw, little turd. Oh. Aww, <laughs> and you bad. killed him. Cock. <laughs> Fuck! Yeah, they're just another variation of the Jester. Those enemies are kind of disturbing yeah those lantern Ooh. guys you need to hit down so that the turtles shrink basically they're they're just another variation of the uh timer jester guys that were in the overworld only instead of having a timer per se they have those lanterns which cause the enemy the turtle dudes to grow bigger i don't remember if there are other enemies that they work on or if it's just with the turtles so uh -huh. i'm sure we'll find out as we continue Kaiser. through the level but Cassia. Cassia. I don't know. But there's the demon uh, archer cupid dudes again. That are, that are anti cupids. Anti cupids. Get your yeah. shit right. My apologies. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the those little ugly dog things turn into those giant red beasts when the lantern dudes are. There you go. So, yeah, basically just. Go for the lantern dudes, weaken the other enemies, and then flame breath them in, or charge in the case of the turtle, and you have nothing to really worry about. And the best thing to do is actually let them shrink down like that. I when the... fucking caught all of your goddamn cousins in Animal Crossing. Eat shit. <laughs> yeah, so just let the let the bigger enemies shrink back down when the lantern timer runs out and get cucked like she did, uh, just did. Listen! You can go back for some mushrooms. They weren't too far away. Shut up. Yo, bitches. Oh, fuck you. Keep going. I know where they are. There you go. Boom. Full health again. Just like that. Make sure you get close enough. Yeah. That's another thing. I don't know if we mentioned it, um, but you need to get close enough to the butterflies for Sparks to actually go after them and eat them, because if you don't, he won't actually gravitate towards them. When you... As, um... As we saw on screen probably several Azizi. times at this point, is easy. Um, that cable really is. That cable is just bad. Let me get the other cable really quick. You keep talking. All right, this is me talking, and I am fucking shit up. Although this seems like a really short level, because if you kind of saw it for a second, um, the return return home portal is like just. Just up there a bit, and the reason I just got cucked by that turtle is because I. Watch Uh. Yep. Yep. Is because he was uh, putting a cable in. So. Look at that guy. <laughs> As you proceed to stand there and. He's cute! Fuck you! Yep. 
No, we not gonna do it though? Yeah, you like flame breath directly on him. Also, you gotta be careful with those smaller turtle enemies because they do still attack, even though they're weaker. <sighs> Especially from their mouth, which is the only part of them, well, their head, which is the only part of their body that you can um, hit, really, unless you like maneuver your way around them. But even then, I'm pretty sure they can turn and face you, so. Right. Bakari. Ugh. Why, my Spyro, thank you for saving me. Oh, man. You it's know? been such a long time. You know? I don't even remember what my own feet smell like. You know what? <laughs> what? You can stop. Oh. I don't know. I thought that was a pretty good impression. Why, well, back in my day. Jason? Yeah? I will cut you. Oh. I'm sure the viewers enjoy my voices. I don't. I know you don't. You're the only person that doesn't. Also, so on this level, um... When I was doing my run through of it, when I first got the game, uh, Reignited Trilogy, obviously. Uh, so, I keep saying, ah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, I had gone through the entire level and got all of the gems, everything. But I was missing one gem. I did the sparks thing, you know, he wasn't like showing that there was like anything. It made zero sense. Could not find this gem. I was pissed. Like, pissed, pissed. Went everywhere. Went through the level. Like, I remember talking to my sister and just, like, flipping the fuck out because I could not find this one goddamn gem. And, you know, I exited the level. I came back. And it was in plain sight where I had already checked. So the game essentially glitched out on me and I couldn't find the fucking gem anywhere. Because it just, it was like, <laughs> nope, sucks to suck. You think you're getting something today? Nope. <laughs> That's weird. I was furious. <laughs> you have no fucking idea. Yeah, I've heard a few, I've heard of a few other stories where a gem like didn't load properly or something or you or like Spyro didn't collect it I mean I, I don't know I've never encountered that myself maybe it's you know just a glitch or something that got patched or what but I do remember hearing about that like mm -hmm. a gem could fall off the edge and if sparks you know sparks wouldn't go after it because it just fell in this really particular place where you know the it wasn't automatically attracted to you or something. I don't know. I don't know uh, what the specifics are regarding that, but... Apara. Apara. Thanks. Oh, you're welcome. He looked not okay inside. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't really care for the camera control. Yeah, I think... I don't know. There, it's There's something weird about the Reignited Trilogy's camera that I just don't like. It either like doesn't lock on proper or like well, it, you know, it always switch follows. Back. It always follows Spyro, but the thing with me is just like I don't know. I don't know if it's something to do with like there's I can't tell if it's like there's a second of like not even a second, but like half a second of lag like when you push the stick, you know, and it like it waits and then turns or if it's like something about it just feels weird like compared yeah. to every other game I play. Like, the default camera has it go, like, has you move the stick one way, and that doesn't do anything, but then if you move, but then, like, I, I, as you saw at the beginning of the playthrough, we switched it the other way, and that still didn't do any, like, I don't know, I can't really explain it, it just feels like no matter which orientation I have for the horizontal movement of the camera, it doesn't feel right, like, either direction, and I, I can't really explain that, I don't know why I feel that way, and this is the only game that I'm like that with, so I'm not sure if it has anything to do with motion blur or, or what, I have no idea, but her potatoes are ready, so we're gonna cut here, give you a little intermission, and we'll be right back. <laughs> We are back from our uh, little intermission. I hope you all enjoyed that. I also hope you can make that jump. Of course I can. Okay. Pro Strats. Epic Gamer. MLG. Are you doing that again? 
You bet your sweet patoot. <laughs> Luckily, you've got like 76, well, even less than that gems left in this level because you're pretty much at the end. Because you only really have this, then you have those, and there was that one other section that we didn't get to see quite yet that you got to go down. And yeah. also, our cat is up again. So if you hear a little bell ringing, that's her. That would be Shika. She is meowing at the TV. I guess her does not like it. Or maybe she's fascinated by it. Hi. Come here. I wouldn't let her get too comfy on you. Well, I also don't want her to get these cables, so. But she's hungry. Well, she can eat her food, not cables. Is that the right way? I'm gonna find a way. I was gonna say, if you get back up to where we took that intermission, I saw some gems at a different point in the level. I know. So I'd just go back that way and... <clears throat> I know where I'm going. Oh, do you now? I do. And where might that be? To hell. Well, that's not Welcome the correct Welcome to my life. <clears throat> Do you remember where you're going? Do you? I mean, not off the top of my head, but I think this is the right way. Of course. Because you need to drop down there. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. Drop. Drop down there. No. Damn it, I was almost there. Okay, that's not the way I would have gotten down that way, but I mean, I guess that works. Of course it does. That was the first time I died compared to your eight. I died so. like oh, a few times and like half of them were on finicky jumps. So oh boo hoo, oh, boo -hoo, -hoo. La -la -la -la. You know what? Yeah, that's what I have to say about that one. I don't want to hear your shit. Okay, then just don't go in the bathroom. So Fucking delete yourself. Well, I mean, it's true. There you go. Yeah, fuck you. And that's 500. Level beaten. And the cat is once again attacking my cable. Here I am. Alright, so. I would just return home. There we go. Later. level, that's what I meant. But I don't remember where this extra room is. Unless it's right here. Oh, I was right. I remembered where it was. Booyah. Skill point and extra life. I was right. Sweet. My gaming instincts succeed once again. Boss fight time. <clears throat> and then you'll get to do the overworld. Hell yeah. So... Jacques Cousteau. Here to spit flow. We did that joke last time. We did. And you know what? It still works. Mm -hmm. At the very least, I'm keeping the cat in place, even if she is constantly playing around. Alright, so is this... This has a skill point, doesn't it? I think it's perfect. Perfect. Okay, so the only two skill points left in the game are perfecting this boss and then uh, the final boss, Nasty Nork. The whole bad guy of this game that we've only seen in the very beginning of the cutscene and never again. Which I wish they would have included like him doing stuff throughout the game. Yeah, so, I'm, yeah. yeah. That's something I definitely think that the second and third game do better. I mean, well, first of all, they actually have cutscenes when you like beat you make it certain uh, certain progress in the game. Mm -hmm. um, they actually have it so that you know, you kind of uh, see an update on where the villain is in their scheme or whatnot, which you know, I appreciate So this is Jacques level which um, I'd say Jacques is my second favorite boss uh, level after metalhead Probably mm -hmm. um, This one's fun. It's got some cool platforming challenges. It it is a little difficult to perfect though, but um, Hopefully I don't have too much trouble Got that no problem I'm eating potatoes. 
Yeah, so I'm doing most of the talking right now because of that, but no big deal. Um, as you can tell, we're clearly a very formal LP channel. Mm -hmm. um, as if that wasn't obvious enough, and I died. But you know what, to be fair, I didn't have any hits as it is, and I don't really care. So I'm just gonna go for that again. And she goes biting your arm. She is, which is making this even more difficult for me. Because it's like, I have to, not only do I have to worry about playing the game, I have to worry about a cat attacking me, or my computer, or my cables. Come and here. I don't need her to be doing any of that right now. Come here. So, yeah, please uh, do something about that. Thank you. Hi, want some potatoes? I don't think she wants potatoes. Go lay down. <laughs> so your dad doesn't get mad. Yeah, that's that's some good advice. Uh, let's see. So I'm pretty sure I need to get the jester dude for that to shrink. But I forget which jester dude it is, or if any jester dude qualifies. So I'm gonna go back. It's him. Is it? No. no. I lied. Yeah, I don't remember. I think I'm gonna have to go like across it's this that way. One. It's all of them, all at once. Also, I love the fact that like Sparks just completely ignored both of those gems right there. Also, what? One thing I have to say yeah. is my potatoes, I don't think they're going all the way. Like the actual little cubed potatoes themselves. Mm hmm. Maybe you should put them in the oven longer. Well, I finished the rest of the recipe. Mm hmm. The little cubes. They're not hard, but like they got that taste to them to where mm -hmm. like. They could have been cooked a little bit longer. They could have been a little softer, but like, what are you gonna do about it? They're potatoes. Right. So the best way to deal with these enemies on the platforms are to pretty much just charge them as fast as you can. What is she doing? Playing with a water bottle. Okay. The best thing to do with these guys is not get too close to them on the bottom, but to just jump and charge them like instantly. Don't hesitate on it because if you do that, their their low swing won't get you because you'll be above them. And you'll hit them fast enough to the point where they can't swing up and get you in time. So, the best thing to do, like I said, is to just, you know, jump and charge them. Um, which, I mean, you're pretty much forced to do that anyways, because they're on a platform. So, they're kind of designed with the idea that they want you to jump and hit them. You know what I think of every time I play this, play this or see this? What? <clears throat> so, the first time that I played this on my own... The Reignited Trilogy, of course. Mm -hmm. This level, I found <clears throat> out that one of our friends was gay. So, when I hear or see this level, it makes me think, Oh yeah, I learned my friend was gay. That's a very, it's a very odd thing to associate with the level, but I mean, hey, if that's what you remember, that's what you remember. I mean, I, we were having, a, not you and I, but in a group call. Mushroom, give me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, so we are making good progress. We got that entire first section done. There's only pretty much this, actually, because we're at the boss, Jacques, which is this weird, like, jack-in-the-box, pogo-sticking clown bat freak. He's a juggalo. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Aim high in life, but watch out for flying boxes. So... That's that's your tip. I didn't know Code Box had wings. Oh my Shout gosh. out to Boxman on Twitter. So there's Jacques going for the present attack. So I'm just gonna and perfect already failed. So I'm gonna go die. SD. In the lava. Let's go. Peace out. And death. She's chilling. She wants to be a gamer. Let's try that again, because I got to perfect this for that skill point. And again, this is easily... Um, Alright, so the best thing to do is to just kind of... Like, let him... Like, don't approach too soon. Pretty much wait for him to throw the present so you can see. That was close. But you basically just 
you, you're not trying to hit him until you get to until he gets on top of those box things. You're pretty much trying to chase him onto it. So, yeah, that's no problem. Hit number two. He throws those presents pretty fast. He does. Like again, this is probably I don't know. He's not necessarily difficult. It's just you gotta be willing Your to. Timing has to be right on point. Like there, I chased him away again. And that's the thing, honestly, just, just chase him to the point where he runs away, and then you can take a breather before you approach him again. Yeah. Like, this is easily the hardest hit, because I'm gonna have to fucking make a jump, dodge his present, make another jump, and there you go. It's what just a little I tight, because you have to worry about the platforming, but... <clears throat> did I seriously miss a gem? <laughs> did I really miss a gem? Oh, okay, apparently I'm missing 49 gems. <laughs> so, oh, well. Or I'm missing a whopping lot more because appa Holy apparently this level has 500 gems and I just completely missed an entire section. So I'm going to head back now because I thought that was the end of the level, but apparently I am mistaken. Whoops. Hi. Oh, okay, that's actually decently lenient. <clears throat> Yeah, I can't believe I completely forgot about this section. Unica. 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 Oh, you're welcome. Play your harp. He didn't play his harp. What the fuck? You told him to. I told him to play his harp and he didn't. <clears throat> I wouldn't listen to shit you say either. Oh, I fucking hated that part. Oh, that's what I gotta do. Here we go. Spin in a circle and try not to die. Okay, yeah, that happened. You're lucky. I am lucky because I <coughs> couldn't tell what happened there. And don't forget there are red gems. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea, but okay. I don't know why either. Yeah. <coughs> uh, hmm. Let's try this again. 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 again Actually, I think it's just again, again twice. Again. But... There we go. There you go. Alright, so that's 466. Am I missing any more in there? I'm not, thankfully. Fuck out of here, boy. Okay, so I can... Ooh, that's not very... Very long at all, actually. Okay, well... Well, what are you gonna do? Just sit there and fucking look at it? Well, I wasn't gonna sit there, but like... I don't know, that just didn't... Oof. You can do it. I no, hope. No, you can't. Barely. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'd like to know why the fuck and you're trying to eat my kneecap. 500 out of 500, level complete. So, I'm not gonna bother going to return home, I'm just gonna exit the level. Yeah. Sweet! So that takes us to the <laughs> final world of the game. Which, uh, is pretty obvious it's nothing um it's nothing thematic i guess like magic crafters or dream weavers or beast makers but um you'll see what it is as soon as we get there once we uh load in 